So there is this one particular trend that has been popping up all over TikTok and YouTube recently, and this trend is called the that girl trend. Basically, that girl is known for eating healthy, working out, waking up early, and overall just living their best life every single day. So in this video, I will be attempting to become that girl. And don't forget to stick around to the end of this video to see my honest opinion of this trend. It's like almost like 9.30 now. I've been in bed for way too long, so I need to get up now. Oh. <sighs> yeah, okay. Um, yeah, so I'm just gonna get up, stretch. Yeah, you get the gist. <laughs> So I just finished going on a walk with Remy and now I think I'm going to do a workout. It's literally going to be like a 10 minute ab workout. I do the same one every time I work out because I mean, I like that one. So, so I think I'm going to do the Pamela, Pamela Rife. I don't know if that's how you say her name, but I'm going to do her 10 minute ab workout with no equipment. So I'm going to go and do that. Hopefully I can get some footage and it's not too cringy. Um, yeah. <laughs> okay, I just finished that workout and I am dead. I'm not even joking. My core is hurting so bad. But now I'm probably gonna chill out, turn the fan on in my room to cool off. Uh, and maybe edit some of this video or watch YouTube or something. So I made myself a smoothie, a mango smoothie to be precise, and it doesn't look the best, but it tastes good. So all it is is basically just mango and honey because I wanted to sweeten it up because it was kind of tart. And I'm eating it with a spoon because... It's too thick to have with a straw, which was like the whole point because I wanted a smoothie, not a smoothie bowl. But I ended up getting a smoothie bowl in a cup. So I'm probably gonna watch some YouTube or do some schoolwork, that sort of stuff. And then I'll see you guys later. So before I do any of my schoolwork, I think I'm going to journal. I have quite a few pages on journaling prompts. I have like three pages of it, so. I'm probably going to pick one of these and just do a little bit of journaling for about maybe 10 minutes or so. You are. You are. Swimming, swimming, swimming like a bird. Drumming, drumming, I can fly to It's 12 11 and I just finished writing my introduction to my English essay. I'm probably going to continue and write maybe one or two more paragraphs. We have to have three body paragraphs, an introduction and a conclusion. And our final, which is what I'm writing now, is due on Monday. So I really want to get this done pretty soon. I just want to knock it out of the way. Um, there isn't actually a draft. We handed in our planning sheet sort of as our draft. Um, so this is the final and I'm just starting. So let's hope I can finish this. I mean, it is Wednesday, so I do have quite a bit of time. I just don't want to have to do it over the weekend. So I at least want to finish it by Friday. So it's 12.30 pretty much. 
and I've just finished writing my first body paragraph so I'm probably going to take a little bit of a break. I'm not quite ready for lunch yet so I think I'm going to have like a pretty late lunch. I might have it at like 2 o'clock or something because I had that smoothie pretty late so I'm just not that hungry at the moment. So yeah, I think I might go and watch some more YouTube until maybe about one o'clock and then start working on either this or my maths assignment. It's currently 2.02 and I've written my introduction, my first body paragraph, my second body paragraph, and my second one's pretty big. I must admit. I still have one more body paragraph to write. I might leave that for tomorrow though, um, as well as my conclusion since it is only Wednesday so I do have some more time to finish it. And now I think I'm just going to read my red, white and royal blue book. Um, I've got like one chapter left of this so I really want to finish it really really soon if you saw my reading vlog you would have seen this book which that was a couple months ago i went into a bit of a reading slump and i didn't read at all for quite a while so i've only just picked this book up last night and i think i read like one or two chapters it's 2 47 so almost three o'clock but i've basically been brainstorming video ideas for the future most of them I had on my phone and I wanted to put them in this notebook as well, but then I did think of some more as well. I've got one page, two pages, and three, like three, like two and a half or something. I'm going to go downstairs and get some stuff for lunch because my stomach is grumbling as we speak and it's almost, it's pretty much three o'clock. And that's not healthy. So, yeah, we'll see what I can get because I don't think we have that much for lunch at the moment. <laughs> Many hours later. Okay, so it's like, why is my hand so shaky? <laughs> it's 5.21. I've been watching YouTube. I did actually manage to eat lunch. I had a salad with salmon in it, which was really, really delicious. I love that salad. I have it like all the time. It's the only salad that I will willingly eat. <laughs> anyway, I think I'm gonna have a shower soon. Then I think I'm gonna go down for dinner. I think we're having bangers and mash, which if you don't know what that is, you're obviously not Australian. Um, <laughs> it's basically sausages or snags as we call them, but it's sausages and mashed potato and veggies. So I think that's what we're having tonight. I think that this trend can be very toxic or it can be very motivating. And I guess it kind of depends on the way you look at life. I personally think that it can be both at the same time. Um, I think it can be motivating in the sense that you get to live your best life will motivate you to be productive and get the things done that you need to get done, but it can also be toxic in the sense that we see all these girls on Instagram and we compare ourselves to them, and especially with the that girl trend, we will compare ourselves to those girls for not being productive enough one day or not waking up early enough and the reality is nobody's life is perfect nobody wakes up every single day and works out every single day and eats healthy every single day and is productive every single day you would just feel so tired and so drained all the time so just know that no one is perfect and no one is productive every single day and it's okay if you don't work out every single day or wake up early every single day. You deserve a rest. And that's the end of today's video. I really hope you enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to like and subscribe and turn the notification bell on so you don't miss any of my videos. Comment your opinion of the That Girl trend. I'd love to hear everyone's opinions and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye! Right there on top of the moon Sit and do nothing I wish we were both